Hey guys, I'm Stubble 8000, and welcome back to more Tales of Symphonia. In the last part, we invaded the Palma Custom Ranch and defeated Magnus, and also blew the place up to bits. In this part, we are starting off with a character's kit, Justice and Strength.中途半端な善意は悲劇を生むだけだ。何だ。正しいことをしようと思うなら、それに伴う力が必要だ。お前たちにはそれが欠けていた。力不足だったわけだ。人よ。ロイドは。ロイドは。もういいジーニアス。
No! Not much of a What? No, I don't even think this is new in me. I'll scan it anyways, just to make sure. I don't think so. <laughs> Was that a bit too much? Well, whatever they were, they were very weak. Anyways, here we are. So you feel to go to the dock. And Colette, you can go talk to that dog over there. And there's also, I forgot there's also a rest station up here, so I really didn't have to go all the way back. But, whatever. It's a wash tub? Yep, it's a wash tub. Wash tubs. Wow, this looks like it'll be fun. I'm going to wait here. Go on ahead without me. What's wrong, Professor Sage? Nothing. I'm not getting in that thing. It looks fun. Come on, let's get in. Yeah, Rain. Ah! Ah. Professor Sage, are you afraid of water or something? I... I was just starting to say, ah, this should be fun. Mm, sure. Alright, so we're here at Steve's dock. And I see a little another dog over there. We established that. Anyways, we got a dog here. Let's quickly name it. No, I don't want to name you. And its name is Bob, apparently. So let me get this straight. We've got Caramel, Blinky, and Bob. Right. Anyways, I believe this guy will sell you some stuff if you need it. I spent some melange gels and some orange and apples in that fight, so I'm going to restock on those real quick. And now this this thing coming up here, I'm actually going to save before it. Because if you fail what's coming up here, the high, your highest person infection points will save you. I'm going to show, apparently, whoever is in first at the end of the video, just so you know what will happen. But, I hopefully won't fail this, this time. Like I said, if you fail this, the highest affection, per highest person who has the most affection points will come save you. However, I shouldn't fail at this. There. Like I said, I'll put it at the end of the video.
But, if you saw right there, there's a little something, something over here that looked familiar. Alright, so with noise coming to the rescue for once, let's move on in here. First of all, we have some new enemies, of course. I believe we have a starfish here. Collect by are you using angel feathers? Don't use that. I command you to. Rain, you can scan that octoslime. Now most of these enemies are going to be weak against lightning, so I'm actually going to be clever here. I have Krakos go on his long range magic. Oh, no. Take Roy, you need to remember that enemy's weakness. Oh man, you're making me study here too. I'm actually going to bring Janus into the fray as well. Because he knows lightning. Oh well, whatever. New enemy, new enemies. We got two of them and this time. We've got a water element. Which I'm actually going to take care of right away. And then we also got the green roper. The drug with anything surprisingly. Now I'm not sure I'll switch up stuff here. I'll double demon thing on that button and I guess Sonic Thrust still. Actually no, just wait for demon thing, why not? here and we got character skit. Power of Salvation. Nah. Oh, 
そうだよスピリチュア様のおかげで世界にマナが満ちて人々が救われてスピリチュア様は天界へと導かれたのなんでその時救われた世界にリザイアンがまた現れたりマナが減少してみんな苦労するようになったんだ救いの塔が消えてしまったからその恩恵を受けられなくなったって教わったけど<笑>ロイド珍しく勉強かしらそんなつもりはないんだけどただ気になってさ塔なんだから誰かが作ったものだろうしってことは誰かが何かしてるのかなとか思ったわけでレミエル様のような天使の皆さんがマナーを与えてくれてるのかななるほど興味深い考え方ね今までは単に救いの塔を救済の象徴とのみ受け止めていたけれど我々ではたどり着けぬ答えではないのか結局救済を完遂せねば導き出せる答えだコレットが天使になったら救いの塔にも行くのかなだったらその時にコレットに聞いた方が早いかもなコレットの土産話に期待するとするか Alright, I'm gonna face this enemy here because I probably won't be getting past them. Have I mentioned how much I hate those starfish enemies? They are so annoying! Uh, I'm not gonna get past you. By the way, using Lightning tiger, tiger, tiger Blade here is super, super overpowered, just saying. Because I do believe they still carry their elemental attributes, even if it's me as an attack. Um, I don't want to do anything here yet. Let's get started. Also, we have a new new enemy, apparently. This is a float dragon. It's really just a seagull, but... <laughs> Fight the other enemies here just for levels. And Lloyd drew a level right there. Not gonna learn anything since he just learned something, so. Get the treasure chest. Stun bracelet. I believe. Actually, now that I think about it, I should really equip this poison charm on somebody. Because that actually resists water a little bit. So, that's pretty nice to have. So, of course, the warrior's a little bit nice to have, too. I'll get that to Carthos. No, not the stun bracelet. I mean, I don't. Okay, it doesn't really have any defensive purposes, so. Let's leave it off. Another circlet, which we only had two girls in the party, so I don't know why we'd have that hint hint. Uh, I guess I suppose if we didn't buy one for rain. Uh, why am I avoiding enemies? Some people are almost up a level. So what I want to do is push this block over to that symbol, should click in, and go all the way back. Alright, backtracking, backtracking, backtracking. I really want to get the others up a level. Because my recommended level for the boss in this place is 17, so... I kind of want to be level 17, you get what I'm saying? 
I'm actually going to edit the cooking here. Cook me a sandwich, Venus. Uh, actually, wait. The sorcerer stone. Sorcerer. Serene thingy. So now I can squirt water, which is pretty useless. I mean, I don't think it even stuns anyways. It doesn't. But what it can do is wake puzzles. That's why we need the block over there. Uh, can I stun you? No, I cannot. Can I unlock this? No, I cannot. But... I gotta admit, I did not know this was here the first time, that little secret room. I was wondering so much if I would get these treasure chests, yet yeah, I never occurred to me for the exact same pillars. That feels leveled up. I don't know until now. I'm not gonna learn anything new. I'm just gonna learn to spell. Probably not until I get hit with a magical element, though. a lot of fish. I've, I've gotten like three snappers in a row. Venus leveled up and I got the memory gem, yes. And he's gonna lose bread which is completely useless in this dungeon because well we're kind of facing water enemies here. I want rain to level up. Alright. Avoid you. I have to fight you, I know that for a fact. I'm not getting past too easily. And Rain learned a spell! You were, I don't think I even had a magical element on me. I guess you just learned it no matter what. back up top because we're doing more backtracking! Yay! Alright, let's unlock the memory seal. Now we're back here. By the way, if you're wondering what the sparklies around my feet are, I have a whole new bottle on just to increase, decrease my encounter rate. Alright. Let's go towards the steel boss. We've got an Agilosia and an Amphitra, I think. They're, I don't know how to pronounce it. Anyways, here's the Amphitra. They weak the fire, oddly enough. I guess it's because it's the opposite element. And then we also have the Anulokia, who's just weak to lightning in general. I, I suggest to get rid of these things first. I thought that's pretty the same for me. I have an idea. Since Rain's the healer, I'll be quick to poison charm from Lloyd and give it to her. Because she seems to be getting beat up. I'll let give her an acne gel. Next Chris probably going after me. Yes, 
money. <laughs> Give me an orange shell ring. We seem to be all filled up. Let's swap back to Genius Sin. I have to revert to his original tactics here. And make it right while the Holy Bubble still lasts. Professor Sage, Colette's sick again. Oh no. We must let her rest immediately. Time to set up camp then. Yes, but if this is going to happen every time she releases a seal, Colette is going to have a difficult journey ahead of her. 
For the time being, I'm going to call the phenomenon angel toxicosis. Colette, are you okay? Does it hurt? I'm fine. It'll go away soon. I'm sorry for worrying everyone. Okay, that's enough. You're not allowed to apologize anymore, okay? I'm sorry. Colette, you're still up? I couldn't sleep. You may feel better now, but you still need to rest. I know. I'll go to sleep in a little bit. Don't worry. But still... Kratos is still awake, too. See? That's because he volunteered to be the Night Watch. You need to rest. Okay. Okay. Good night. Good night. Please, dream some good dreams for me, Lloyd.